Am I the asshole? For saying that no one was getting any food until I finished my work? I live with my husband Tom. He has a child Anna that he sees on weekends. I love Tom a lot, but honestly he can be a little exhausting sometimes. Anna is always sweet. A little background context in my family, my mother always did much of the work. She had a high paying job just like my dad did both of them software engineers but my dad was often on the couch playing video games while she worked on her laptop and cooked and cleaned all at the same time. I hated the dynamic and brought it up with my mom often but she had always just defended my dad saying that he did a lot of work. I promised myself that I was never going to grow up and marry someone like my dad. Now, years later, I'm kind of in that position. It's true that Tom does bring in a lot of money, but so do I. The first year or so was good. Sometimes he forgot things and had to be reminded, but overall he did what he was supposed to. After that, he just started slacking until I was doing the majority of the household chores and work. Every time I brought it up and tried to get him to change, he at first promised he would and then go back to his normal routine a few days later, and then later on he would just sulk every time I asked him to do the chores. I guess I kind of stopped asking because it never got anywhere. Over the weekend, Tom brought Anna over. I was working on a big project on my laptop, and had been since early morning. He went out with Anna for breakfast, and then came back around noon asking what was for lunch. I told him I would sandwiches or something later because I was busy. He kind of looked at me weirdly, and then went and sat on the couch and played video games while Anna napped. Every once in a while he would look over at me, and then go back to playing video games. Later he finally puts down the controller and came up to me and asked why the sandwiches weren't ready yet. I told him that he knew I had a big project I was working on and would do it later. He tried to take the computer away from me coaxingly and saying that Anna would be hungry and that the project could wait. At that point I kind of snapped. I was stressed from the project and I hadn't eaten all day my fault and I sort of yelled. I told him that he had arms and legs and a working brain so he could make lunch too, and that he does this all the time, and that he needs to start pulling his weight. He got startled but then yelled back that cooking was my job I usually do the cooking and usually it isn't a problem because I like cooking. I told him fine. I said I was sorry for trying to push my duties onto him. I had been about to make the sandwiches, after a small portion of the work was done, to relax with a bit of cooking before returning to the project, but I then told him that I absolutely would make the sandwiches but only when all my work was done. He started whining, but I told him either he finds some other form of food for him and Anna, or they wait. And Am I the asshole? Not the asshole. Your husband has conditioned you into doing all the work around the house and you've let it slide, you even admitted you stopped asking because it never got anywhere. Now you've got a 32-year-old son on top of a 5-year-old stepdaughter. He is so lazy, immature and you shouldn't put up with this anymore. Put your foot down with him he's fully capable of making a few sandwiches for lunch, which is the easiest thing to make especially as he knows you're busy on a big work project. These types of stories give me such a headache. Overall, not the asshole. But you're the asshole to yourself for apologizing to him for pushing your duties onto him. What? You were working. He was playing a video game. An actual child could make a freaking sandwich, but not your adult husband? You need to nip this in the bud now or it'll only get worse. Not the asshole but why are you still married to him? The idea of a grown man pouting like a child and refusing to do chores or make his own lunch is deeply unattractive. Not the asshole. You're married to an entitled brat. Whether you do the majority of the cooking or not, the man can make himself and his kid a damn sandwich. Not the asshole. He got startled but then yelled back that cooking was my job. Typical misogynistic bullshit, and all the other stuff comes with it. Not worth IT. I told him fine. I said I was sorry for trying to push my duties onto him. You better not be, he doesn't do his part of the chores, you don't owe him anything. It's one thing if you like doing it and you offer to do it constantly, but nothing in the household is your job. If that's how you think you're getting into conservative not job territory. If you don't like doing the majority of chores, then stop doing them. Tom is obviously lazy, but you're enabling it. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. Him trying to take the computer away is a serious ah move. He could go make sandwiches for the family since it was clearly an important project. Sounds like time for a serious discussion about shared responsibilities and chores. You both have duties to your child and family. He shouldn't demand you be doing everything. Not the asshole for the situation, but it is incomprehensible to me that you apologized about pushing your duties onto him when your husband is perfectly capable of making you and his daughter sandwiches. 
Instead of blowing up you could have said the sandwich stuff is in the kitchen in the usual place, I'd like a X while you were making sandwiches for Anna and yourself, and a glass of X. Thanks honey. And you should be doing it regularly enough that it isn't a surprise. Info What are the circumstances that led him to leave the mother of his child with an infant toddler to marry you? Was his ex-wife crazy and a nag and did she just not understand his needs anymore once the baby came? Was he fully single and living independently on his own doing the weekend custody solo when he met and became serious? You're your mom. Your husband is Lizzie and isn't doing his share. You need to demand changes in your home ASAP or you will end up miserable and resentful. ETA not the asshole but you need to grow a backbone and stand up for yourself properly. Not the asshole he's a grown man with the full capability to make his own meal. Not only that, but he should have the level of mature insight to realize that because your job takes up so much time, he should support you through some of those household tasks. Sandwiches aren't hard, chores aren't hard, and him showing that he believes that you should do all of it despite the work you do is problematic. It sounds as though he hasn't been willing to take the feedback to heart either. Not the asshole. A sandwich isn't cooking it's a freaking sandwich, it would have taken him all of what 3 minutes to do it. You need to put your foot down, he could have bought home sandwiches from breakfast to eat later knowing you had a project you needed to work on. He could have even been thoughtful and bought you food because you hadn't eaten all day but he didn't, he treated you like a servant instead. Not the asshole. Your husband is lazy and immature, and avoids his responsibilities at all costs. Honestly, you shouldn't tolerate his behavior any longer. He needs to improve himself. And he could easily make food for himself, his daughter and you. That s not solely your duty, and he is the one who makes his daughter go without food, not you. He s not supportive at all and needs to pull his weight, otherwise this marriage is doomed. If you cook, what family household tasks are his to do? He should be doing something. Not the asshole. He's a parent his first priority should be feeding his child not playing video games and wondering when the lunch fairy will deliver the sandwiches. His attempt to take the laptop from you while you were working is absolutely unacceptable. I know this sub likes to toss around abuse, but between this attempt to sabotage your work, his weaponized incompetence, sulking, and his vision of you as mommy bang made run how many more red flags do you need? Not the asshole. Your husband sounds like he's gotten lazy. Personally I recommend you stop doing everything and start doing for yourself to see how he reacts. I mean look how he reacted to the sandwich situation. Albeit you did say you would make the sandwiches but you were also working and he could see that. He's plenty capable of contributing to the household chores. He went out with Anna for breakfast, and then came back around noon asking what was for lunch. Didn't know, what are you making? Later he finally puts down the controller and came up to me and asked why the sandwiches weren't ready yet because you've been playing video games instead of making them. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. But why didn't you tell him to make his own sandwich initially? You're being unfair to yourself by tolerating his entitlement. Asked why the sandwiches weren't ready yet yelled back that cooking was my job. Not the asshole really these two things really tell the whole story. You need to push back, he needs to start pulling his weight and be a little less whiny about things he can control. Sounds like he has 1950s attitudes if he can't even make a sandwich for him and his daughter and you. Duh. Why are you with him all he does is give you extra work because you now have to take care of him and his child if you left him you could get on with your life and have some free time. If you make money, cook, and clean why do you need your hubby? Especially since he tried to sabotage your work? You know with trying to take your laptop mid really important project? Do you also do most of the child care for Anna on the weekends he has her? Seriously I'm not seeing a benefit to having this guy around not the asshole. Not the asshole but my god you need to grow a spine and either enforce boundaries or tell him to hit the road. A 32 year old man who thinks whining like a sulky toddler is a reasonable behavior and is incapable of preparing sandwiches, aka the most basic of meals? He sounds pathetic. Not the asshole why are you being treated like his maid? Sandwiches aren't cooking. He is lazy. I think there should be another conversation where you absolutely stick to your guns on what a partnership looks like. Not the asshole. Not the asshole but you need to get out before you get pregnant. You didn't want this life, so don't force yourself to stay in it. I am genuinely appalled and devastated that you apologized. Girl. This is like. Literally fucking Stockholm Syndrome. GTFO. 
not the asshole this isn't about the sandwiches, this is about you being rightfully tired of doing most of the work in your relationship you guys need to talk about this. And you should start expecting him to contribute, and not let him get away with being an extra child in the household. And by that, I mean stop doing more than what you think is fair, and let him use his fully functioning arms and legs to do the rest. If you keep doing everything for him, he will never feel the consequences of him slacking of. Not the asshole. Making a freaking sandwich is not cooking, he's more than capable of doing that himself, hell, with supervision Anna could probably do it. Sounds like you're having a long day, I'm thinking you should order pizza delivery for dinner tonight. Not the asshole. That grown man can make sandwiches for him and his daughter. I don't care whose job it is to normally make food. It's ridiculous that an adult doesn't just handle what they need. Don't let him treat you the same way your dad treated your mom. Also he let a 5 year old go hungry good parenting. Not the asshole, JFC, his hands fucking broken. He asked, why the sandwiches weren't ready yet? My response would have been, because you haven't made them yet. To he's super entitled. Not the asshole you married a child. Not the asshole you should not accept this behavior from him. He is a grown man. He can make food and provide food for his daughter. It's crazy what seemingly smart successful people will put up with from their significant others. Do not continue with this relationship dynamic. It has to change or you have to find an actual adult to be in a relationship with. Good luck. Not the asshole but why are so many men like this? Not the asshole he got startled but then yelled back that cooking was my job. You should have responded I assume since you constantly slack on your duties and leave them for me to deal with, I figured you wouldn't mind if I returned the favor. Cooking is your job but how is making sandwiches cooking? If he's so incompetent he can't figure out how to assemble one, you should file for divorce.